This is Daniel Kelly. It's not recording anything. Oh, your lens cap is on. Zoom out. Newport, Vermont. I do not want to be transferred to the Newport Police Department. I would like to speak to the state police, if anybody. That is correct. Mm -hmm. That is also correct. This is Daniel Kelly. Well, we contacted the Newport Police Department well over an hour ago. Uh, originally, um, I walked over to the police department and I was trying to report that Wayne Bergeron had mildly assaulted me. Um, it was not an offense to me. I was not expecting him to be arrested for that. Uh, I had left his house and gone over to the police department and then his niece went down to his apartment who is connected to me by being my ex-girlfriend and is now my good friend. Um, so Wayne then slammed the door on her hand and, uh, I don't know, I guess he then flipped out, smashed the stove, like screamed at her, and she wound up leaving the apartment very quickly under great duress. And, um, I don't know, it is an assault that occurred on her by his slamming her hand in the door. Um, that is correct, yes. Uh, so when I reported to the police my mild assault, they asked me if I was recording, which I was. I had my video camera right out in the open, and I was recording, and they told me that I was not authorized to record any conversations and that they were not going to any longer speak to me. Um, I then left the police station, and I found Amanda on the street, and she described to me her having been assaulted by Wayne, and I told her, you need to go call 911. Wayne cannot get away with this. Um, what had happened earlier than that is that uh, this guy who is indicted for child pornography, Ray Crickard, who is Amanda's husband presently, but she has filed divorce on him, um, he, uh, we had a conversation with him over the phone and we recorded the conversation. She was trying to ask him if he would testify the truth about what he knows about her, uh, her, uh, son, Andrew, that, uh, she had been assaulted by Andrew on numerous occasions. And instead of, um, I don't know. So he he said uh, that, you know, he would help her with that, you know, that he would tell her or he would provide her, you know, whatever testimony she needed on that, but that she needed to help him with prosecuting me, that, you know, he wanted to have me blamed for the child pornography that was on his computer that dates back to 2007. Now, I didn't meet Amanda Crickard until, until late in 2009. Yeah. Right now, I need an investigation opened on the Newport Police Department as to why they have not responded to Amanda Crickard having been assaulted by her uncle, which she, she called and in good faith reported. Uh, it was more than an hour ago. No, absolutely not. They have refused, they have refused to hear, they have refused to hear my report of Wayne assaulting me, and they did not at all respond to Amanda's report that Wayne assaulted her. Well, I would rather speak to the state police. Is this call being recorded? Okay, well, I don't understand why you would, I don't understand why you would connect me with the same corrupt police department that has already ignored the call times two. You know, what, do you want the call to be ignored times three? Well, we need a state police response. We need the state police to respond to this and to take a report. 
Okay, well, do you do you have do you have the number for the state police? Yeah, definitely. Let me have that. Mhm. Mm oh, that's okay. I'm just going to call the state police. Thanks. Yeah, I got a big mess on my hands right now. I hope you guys can help me out. All right. Um, much earlier, uh, about an hour and a half, almost two hours ago, my ex-girlfriend was having a conversation with her now husband, and uh, we recorded the conversation. She, uh, she agreed that the conversation needed to be recorded, and so I sat with my video camera and I recorded the conversation. Uh, he is right now indicted for child pornography. Um, she was trying to ascertain from him a statement as to her son having on numerous occasions uh, essentially beat her, that uh, her son had... Um, I don't know, had forced her to prevent him from hurting her. Uh, one time she was pregnant, he kicked her in the stomach, she grabbed him by the, by the arms and held him on the bed, and, I don't know, eventually the Child Protective Services took him out of her custody. She is grateful for that, and she wishes that the Child Protective Services were really protecting her child, but her child has now gotten way worse. He never used to set fires, and now he's setting fires. You know, so, I mean, his life is just going way wrong compared to how it was in her house. In her house, you know, he was a golden child compared to how he is now in protective services. So she was just trying to ascertain from her husband uh, testimony as to uh, what his real or what his understanding of the reality was. And she did that. Uh, th that was right here in her apartment. No, 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 no. This situation gets way deeper. This has already been reported to the Newport police, and they refuse to respond. Be no, 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 no. Beyond, beyond that, she was then assaulted by her uncle, who is a pedophile, that has been accused by his family and accused by very many other people of having abused children. And, and he called the child... He called... I don't need to listen to anything. I need, I need to tell you what the situation is because you don't understand the situation if you think I need to talk to the Newport Police Department. They have already on... They have... The state police... The state police have precedent over because they are state police. They are Vermont police. They, they do not need permission from Newport to enter Newport and to do an investigation. Is this call being recorded? Who is your supervisor? What's your name? Julie what? What's your badge number? Oh, I have your name and that's it? Julie, who's on duty? What, what is the time right now? 6.02. Okay, we're at the new... Uh, right? Okay, and you refuse to give me your badge number? Why don't you have a badge? Are... You're a dispatcher, and you're going to tell me what the state police business is. Please, give me your supervisor. Hung up.
Yeah, my ex-girlfriend, she reported being assaulted to the Newport Police Department more than an hour and a half ago. They did not respond. I, I reported being assaulted by the same person about 20 minutes before being assaulted by that guy who is her uncle, and they did not respond to my call. This has been an uh, ongoing situation with me and the Newport Police Department. Every time I report being assaulted, they ignore the situation. And so now they're ignoring my girlfriend, having been assaulted by, or ex-girlfriend rather, having been assaulted by the same person. So, I have not asked for the ranking off there. Okay, well, you know, I have an emergency line, so I would like you, I would like you to call. No, it's my job. You know what's my job? is to document the corruption. And that's what I'm doing. I'm recording this phone call, just like I recorded the last phone call that I was hung up on. I don't think you're really trying to help me. You're trying to put me in contact with the police department that I already dealt with, that I've dealt with a bunch of times, that I was assaulted, and that they ignored every time I was assaulted. Now they're ignoring my ex-girlfriend being assaulted. I'm recording this, I'm gonna post it to YouTube, probably within moments of us getting off the phone. Be on some flyers and distribute them all over this town. And now it's gonna extend to the state police. You know, I already have flyers prepared to document the Newport Police Department corruption, and now I am going to document the State Police Department corruption. I already was on service at uh, the Derby Barracks of the Newport State Police Department as having told me that I have to deal with the same corrupt police department that has already ignored my request to run to assault charges many times. Over. So, what's your name? What's your name? All right, you're telling me what I can do. I just, I'm just sitting in. Okay. Ask the ranking officer. Mm -hmm. And he might respond. Okay, what do I do when he doesn't respond to my girlfriend's assault complaint? Okay, and obviously he is not on duty. I'm pretty sure I was dealing with the sergeant when I was in, when I was in their front. Okay, so so I gotta try three, I gotta try three officers at a corrupt police department, and then I gotta go to the selectmen. Wow, that sounds like some really bogus stuff. Do you think that if the whole police department is corrupt, that the selectmen is not corrupt? All the way up through the whole federal government. That's your word on this. And your name is Dispatcher Brian. Do you have like a badge number? Is there some way to ID you? Okay, well, I cannot wait until the treason is prosecuted. Happy plasma rifling. What did you do with the Newport State or with the Newport uh, police number? The Newport police number. What did you write that on? Oh yeah. Okay, that's right. I remember now.